part two of the girls' bedroom makeover, and this week I've been trying my hand at carving. I started off with the straight bits, and that was fairly easy. Definitely something you can do yourself with the help of a few panel pins like this one stuck in the wall. Just make sure that you use plenty adhesive. Next came the tricky bit, the corners, and you need to decide whether these are internal ones like this or external like this. To make all your cuts, you'll need a mitre box and a saw. Making sure the side of the mitre is higher than the carving and not lower. Something I found out, wasting two hours trying to make do. To work out which angles to cut, I used this template. Screenshot here. Once the corners were cut, I could put them into place. In the interest of health and safety, a ladder would be much safer than a chest of drawers. Once all the corners are up, you can start filling in the gaps. I used an adhesive and filler, which was a total bargain at about two quid. It was really good at holding it in place, but didn't dry too quickly, so you could still move it around did a great job at filling the holes and it wiped off really easily. It has made such a difference to this room and I can't wait to get it painted. 